Once you have done these uh, assembly drawings, so I want to show you on how to do the draftings. What you need to do, you need to go to mechanicals and drafting. Okay, we use A3. Okay. Okay, so as usual, you can go to, go to sheet background to, do, to, to edit your title blocks. You can create title blocks. You will use the sample of one, sample one title blocks. Okay, all the details you can put it here. Okay, so what you need to do next, you need to do to the working view. Okay. Working view, then you need to start with the front view. Okay. Select the product. For example, this is your front view. Okay, you can move this one here. Then you need to select as uh, multi view, right side, right view, and the top view. Okay, this is the first angle projections. So you can change this one to third angle projection. This is a common like this. Okay, so we need to redo again for the projection. Okay. So select this one as a right view and another one as a top view. Then you can select your isometric. Something around here. Okay, you notice that your drawing is very big. What you need to do, you can change the, you can scale it down. Okay, so you have this one. Okay, this one correction. Isometric should not have a hidden line. Okay. So this is your drawing. So what you need to do, you can add your section view here. For example, I want to section at the center of this one. Okay. Uh, sorry. Yeah, I want the section is top view. Okay. So this is your section view. Okay. So you can edit this one. Double click here. You can change it to be more smaller one. Samples. Okay, so you have this section view, you have the multi view. So next you can do the dimension. So the important of dimension to make sure this product is, uh, when the assembly you have the idea of the length, the width and something like that. For example, this one, you can dimension. So select the important dimension eh? for the detailed dimension is already in your part drawing. For example, the height. What is the height? This is important. For example, you want to fit in any room or any place, we know the height, the total height, the total width, the total length. Okay, how big is the radius? But in details, you can follow the uh, we can refer to the uh, what we call it uh drawing, eh? Part drawing. Example, this is a sample. Select. Okay, so 
So what you need to do is complete everything. You need to change the unit. Uh, should be an MM. Then the scale will be one over two and the rest. Okay, this is how uh, the section view uh, of uh, assembly drawings and also the dimension of assembly drawings.